Hey guys, Paul Lou here, and welcome back to Pokemon Y Walkthrough. So, last episode was pretty rage inducing, but uh, we ended it up fighting our rival Serena, and we got the Absolite, which is the start. Oh, yeah, like everyone's dead. We are going on a uh, Mega Stone hunt today, and this is only able to be done between 8 p.m. and 9 p.m. So it is currently 7.52. Uh, I decided to start a little bit sooner so I could get, you know, talking. And I could get everything done that I need to beforehand. So we can just, so whenever it does hit 8, I get the full hour span to grab all the Mega Stones. We're going to grab as many as we can. Um, there are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 11 that we have to get within the hour which I'm sure we can do I have I have them all pulled up right here and then there are two more no three more that we need to get that don't require a, a time constraints all right so this this guy's spinning up let's talk to professor sycamore I always want to say juniper I don't know why why, hello, Boldu. Running around all of Kalos is, n is actually rather tiring, is it not? Oh yeah, I'm the one making you do that, aren't I? Terribly sorry about that. Well, Serena may have already told you, but I found a way to power up the Mega Ring. Before we get to that, however, let's talk about Mega Stones briefly. My theory is that they're special stones ir irradiated by the light, the energy of the legendary Pokemon Eveltal, fired from the Ultimate Weapon 3,000 years ago. And that's what I think they are. It's even possible that these stones, like fire stones, were turned into these mega stones. So that's what the mega ring... So, what's the mega ring that you're holding? The mysterious stone transforms feelings felt towards Pokemon into some kind of wavelength. The mega ring works in a similar way to how it's ob this object over here works. It's an object that changes sunlight into a mysterious light. For one hour starting at 8 p.m., the sundial starts emitting light. This mysterious object has towered over the city here for over 3,000 years. Its relationship to the Mega Ring isn't understood at all yet. Now, let's get down to the heart of the matter. Poldu, try touching the sundial. And you're blind. <laughs> nah. You were exposed to the legendary Pokemon's energy in Team Flare's secret HQ. And the Mega Ring has absorbed the power of the Sundial. These two powers have combined to upgrade your Mega Ring. Now it will react to underground Mega Stones, but only when the Sundial is emitting light. I'm sure these stones hide in every corner of Kalos. Use this power to find them. And there begins our hunt. Now, real quick, this is already emitting light. Let me check something. If we go... Oh, no, this is going to stop in six minutes, isn't it? Daylight savings is such a bitch. Okay, let's get to this. First one we're heading to, I, uh, I don't know if we're going to be able to do this. I might have to cut this and finish tomorrow. Yeah. As we're going to go to get Alakazam's, which is in Relic Cave. Or, sorry, Relic. Reflection Cave. Um, if you guys remember back to that episode, there was a little chamber in there with shining lights. Or like, with a sh spotlight. Uh, we need to get repels going. Oh, this really s sucks. Plates... There we are, super pal. And let's get on our bike. Oh, we can't use the bike in Reflection Cave. But yeah, I I screwed up. I thought the DS would automatically do it. Obviously, I was wrong. So here, here I am, like waiting for the perfect time. To get this recorded. I, I wanted to do it yesterday. Oh, fuck. 
wanted to do it yesterday, but um, I was busy, and then by the time I, I was done being busy, it was already past nine. So I was like, okay, I'll do it today, um, and I'll start a little bit before seven, and it'll be perfect. But we're going to get at least one. Should go over here. As you can see, uh, there's something shining in the middle of the spotlight now. And we have found the Alakazite. Alright. Next up. Uh, escape rope. Next up is the Banette. Is, is the Megastone for Banette. Uh, how we're going to do this. Or, well, actually, no. Next up is going to be Gyarados. Because I know that one's easy. We're going to go to Corway Town. Uh, this is the town with a bunch of waterfalls. And where you find it... Come on. I love the flying animation. It just takes forever. Alright. Where you get this is if we go to our buddy over here that sells us... That's not where I wanted to go. Sells us the fresh water. Where was he? Oh, yeah. You go behind him, and what is that? Something shining in the waterfall? The Gyaradosite. So there's two. Um, now we can go to... Uh, let's let's do Mawile. I'm going to try and do the, the quick ones while I still have time. So we got Alakazam, we got Gyarados... Now, Mawile Stone. If you go into, uh... What city is this? Camphrier Town. And you head up here to the Charbonneau Castle. Uh, then you, you... You head on upstairs. And you should see it... Right here. It's just twinkling away. Got the Mawile Light. Mawile Light? Mawile Light? I don't know. But that's where that one is. And then... Yeah, I want to just keep using repels. Okay. Let's get the hell out of here. In Lavier City... We will be the... Medicham. So, Lav... Lavier City. It's the fairy-type gym city. It is apparently, it is in front of the water well. And we are really running out of time here. <laughs> right here. The Metachamites. Alright. Now. Um, we're going to try and grab Garchomps. I don't know if we're going to have time, but what you want to do is you want to head to the Pokemon League. I feel like we're going to run out of time, and if we do, I'm going to cut and we'll, I'll, I'll rejoin you guys. It'll be another day for me, but we're going to get all these this episode, I promise. So you want to head down into Victory Road. Straight shot down here. Gonna surf back out here and uh, hop back on our bike, and we want to head. We want to head back outside, you know, where we fought Serena, oh. and where we fought, or not where we fought, uh, grr. where we fought Serena, and where we found that healer, heal, healing lady. Hopefully we're not too late. But if we... If you rock smash this wall... Oh, I didn't rock smash it while I was here. Okay. Rock smash. It's fine. Because we're, we're almost done with this series. I don't need... Uh, power up punch anymore. We beat the Elite Four. And we're almost done with the game, actually. Come on. Pokey. Rock Smash. Uh, excuse me? 
This is a rock smash wall, is it not? There we go. Did we did we miss it? Because it is currently 801. Should be 90. Yeah. All right. So um, I'm gonna cut here. When we come back, the guard chomp, guard chompite. I don't know what it's called. Um, I think guard chompite will be right here next to us, and it'll be tomorrow for me. So, yeah, one second, guys. And now the guard chompite is back. <laughs> All right, so it is the next day. Um, so let's let's just get right back into this, like like nothing happened. Because to you guys, nothing did happen. To me, a whole day passed. But that is the Garchomp I found. Um, let's see, we got the Gyarados, we got... Metacham. Let's go... Oh, we got Mawile as well. Let's go and grab Kangaskhan. Which is down... We need to go to Ambret Town. And we are going to have to go into the glittering cave, so uh gonna have to ride the Ray Rayhorn for this one. Kinda s I don't know. I don't know how I feel about the riding Pokemon thing. It's cool, but it takes forever to move. Um We do have repels on, so that'll make this better, but and we don't we, we can just fly away, we don't have to ride it back. But, uh, when you're just wanting to get someplace to hurry up. I mean, we're not really hurting for time right now, because it's, it's 8.05. But, you know, any time constraints you have. Like, I'm sure, uh, like, if you watch any Pokemon speedrunning on Twitch, uh, I know Worcester tried to speedrun this the day that it came out. I didn't watch any of it, because I didn't want to get, I didn't want the any spoilers or anything but I'm sure he's he was just cussing up a storm with these because <laughs> they take forever okay so in here yeah sure you want to go to the first bend take it and go all the way to the back and here we go there's the Kangaskhanite Kangaskhanite King King Gas... Yeah, King Gas Knight. Okay. And then we're gonna leave. So, let's see. We got all of those. Now let's go ahead and get Scizor. So, f if to get Scizor, you are going to want to go back... Is it this place? Or is it... Yeah. I'm gonna go back to Dendemil Town. And, uh... We are going to head north from Dendemil Town to back to the Frost Cavern. Get on our bikes. And uh, we're going to have to go through... We're not going to really have to do too much uh, with the sliding puzzles. But we will have to mess with some sliding ice stuff, which is... It's no big deal, um, but let's go ahead and head on this way, and then head over here. Like we're almost there. That's, that's how easy this one is. <laughs> like you don't really have to do any of the. Like when we were here the first time, we had to do the diagonal ice slides to get. It was just TMs, and it's, it's not back there. It's. It's in the main chamber where Ob uh, Obama Snow is. So go straight down here. Oh, I went on the one, one way I didn't want to. Okay, here we go. Here we are. I have to sneeze. I'm gonna remember this time to get it, make it go away. Maybe. Up. Oh, never mind. It went. It went away. Because last time I sneezed during a recording of Pokemon Y, I did not edit it out. <laughs> like I said I was going to because I forgot but we are here so Obama Snow if we go back here you can see it sparkling it's right behind him the Scissorite 
And I hope we have escape ropes left. Please. Yes, we got three left. Perfect. Okay. So there's that one done. Now we are going to fly to... Um, we're going to fly to... What is this place? Shalur City. And we're going to go into the Reflection... Reflection Cave, right? Refle oh, wait, no. We did that, didn't we? The, do, do we have the Al Alakazam one? Let me... Type... Epsil... No! Oh, yeah, it's right here. Okay. So, we... Oh, we almost have all of them that are able to be gotten in both X and Y. So, um... Last one... Is... I'm gonna go here, right? Yeah. Is on Route 22. And is the Banatite. We're gonna need Waterfall for this. Just fine. Let's go. Oh, yep. And go over here. This is where we caught Truffles. The Pyroar. And you want to go all the way over here to water, and you're going to need to surf. And then from here, um, you do need waterfall for this one. Oops. Right. Stringy, you're going to learn waterfall again. Yep. And get rid of toxic. I don't think I ever used that. Like, I, I taught Stringy Toxic for the Elite Four, and I don't think I ever used it. Oh well. I don't, I got all, like, all geared up with TMs and stuff for the Elite Four, and I, I really didn't need to. But, we are down here. I'm gonna go over here. You need to fight this guy if you have not done so already. Do, 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 do. He has just a Lucario. No big deal. And it's... I don't even know. Yeah, it's level 31. Like, everyone down here is really... Every, or everything down here. Trainers and wild Pokemon are low level. Which doesn't make sense, considering Waterfall is the last thing you get to. So you would assume that the trainers... That you can't get to without Waterfall would be your level but whatever so over here this is the chamber of emptiness and chamber of emptiness is empty except for the spooky plates and as you can see in the back there the banatite all right so that concludes pretty much concludes well, that concludes the ones that you can only get from 8 p.m. to 9 p.m. in both X and Y. Now we are going to do the 8 p.m. through 9 p.m. Y only Mega Stones. The first one we are going to do is Agron. We have to go back to the Sillage City Gym, which is right here. Which I thought this one was kind of cool. It's it's in a city, or it's in the gym. Um, and it looks like, from the guide I'm looking at, these locations work for both X and Y. Just the mega stone that you uh, receive from the location is what's different. So if you if you have X and you're wondering where, like, you're wondering where the uh, mega stone is. Agron is the Y version, which is the one we will be getting. And, uh... Tyranitar is the one for X. So you go up here, and it is right here. Agronite. Or for X, it will be the Tyr... 
Tyranitarite. Or Tyrana. I don't know what it's called. Tyranitarite? Sounds right to me. So, let's get back down. And we are going to head to... Uh, ch -ch 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 we're going to head to the Santaloon Forest. Which is the only forest in this game, actually. We're going to head there from... I forgot what the... Aquamarine Town? Is that what this was called? I don't remember. Let's see. Oh, Aqua Cord Town. Sorry. We're going to go across here. And we're going to go up. We, we want to enter from Route 2. You can do it from both, but it's on Route 2 side. I'm going to go behind the tree. And up here. Go over here. And right there, sparkling in the grass. This one is the Heracronite, which is for Heracross. Or in X, it would be for Pincer. So we're going to go ahead and leave. Get the last one. Which would be for Y, Houndoom, and for X, Manetric. But this one, um, you can only get uh, Houndoom in X, but you can only get uh, Manetric in Y. So they have opposites, opposite stones, and opposite, I don't know. It, you have to have either both versions or find someone who's willing to trade. Or, I don't, I don't know. I don't know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> We're going to have to fly. I'm trying to do like two, three different things at the same time. We're going to fly to Dendemil Town. We're going to go out to Route 15. Which, now that I think about it, did we ever go down Route 16? We did not, did we? Well, we're going to be going down Route 16. I meant to come back here. And not, like, not come back here after the... After the, uh, Elite Four. I meant, like, pretty soon after. Because this side... Or have we not been down here? Hold on. I guess I'll find out. I guess not. But you want to come down here, and you'll find this guy cycling around. He has a manetric. Wonder if he has a Hound Doom in X. That'd be kind of cool. Um, but we're just gonna get rid of this guy real quick. And then we're going to grab the Mega Stone right behind him. Finally go to level 69. But, uh... This is where you get the Super Rod. Houndoomanite. Achieved. Hey. Oh, okay. Um, so that is all of the time-specific... Mega Stones. Now, the Blaziken Knight can only be gotten through the Mystery Gift Torchic. There's no other way to get that. So, um, if you have not done the event yet, go ahead and do that. Um, I think it's supposed to expire sometime in December, so you still have time to do that. And it's only one, you can only get one per game. Um, now, all the previous are all the stones that do not need times um, there are let's see if you count all the starters we're gonna have to go here we're gonna go to Lumoy City um, there is the Charizard Char Char Charizardite Blastoise Knight and Venusaurite but there's two of the Charizards ones because there's one for X and one for Y now the one you get what? Ahem! Bolu, please excuse me, I need only a moment, or perhaps three. There's something I really need to talk to you about. Please come to the Looker Bur Bureau. 
The building is close to Rogue Plaza. I can't say any more right now. I will expect to see you soon. We'll be doing that in a later episode. That man's a real looker. So it's like a little side quest. Um, but we want to find a taxi. But you get to the, your first starter mega stone with the Kanto starter that you pick, right? So we're going to go to shopping and we are going to go into the stone emporium. And inside these, this stone emporium, we got lots of cash. Oh, this should be good. Go inside. And there's this rich man over here to the side who sells the other ones. So you this Venusaurite for just $500,000. So what do you say? I'm going to say no. You can get everything that you did not... You can get... Let's see, where and why? So he'll also sell me the Charizardart... <laughs> Charizardite... Y, along with the Venusaur, uh, Venusaurite, but you can, if you max out your style, which is by doing a bunch of different things around, um, around Lumoy City, you can get it down to 100,000 a piece, so I'm not going to spend the 500,000, but that is where you get those. Um, we already got the Lucaria Knight, that is given to you if through progressing through the story by Corinna after you beat after you beat her from the gym uh, we already got the Obama Snow White from saving the Obama Snow and Frost Cavern um, the Ampharosite we have not gotten yet that is located uh, just south of Sea Spirit's Den in Azur Bay if I pull up my map I will show you where that is we have not been there yet because it's not it's not something you expect to go to but it so it's all gonna be low level because we skipped it but it's right here Coramine City if you go to Route 12 and surf up you will hit Azure Bay and eventually the Sea Spirits Den yeah, Azure Bay um, so that's where the Ampharo site is and that, that is given to you by an old man. So just talk to people that you find on the islands out there and you'll get you'll get it. The Gingarite we got in uh, La, La Vare City from talking to one of the Hex Maniac girls. Um, she, she just hands you the Gingarite. And the Aerodactylite is obtained by talking to one of these scientists in the Ambret Town uh, Fossil Lab. And just after after you've done your whole quest uh, of beating Team Flare out of uh, Glitter Glitter Cave, then uh, you go back and you can you can talk to one of the guys off to the side and he'll give you that. So that just leaves two more: the Mewtwo Knight, which for us will get the Mewtwo Knight Y, and then the Gardevoirite. The Gardevoirite is here in Lumoy City. Um, we need to find a cab. No, I don't need those anymore. Because I don't know where this is. This place is huge. There's no, like, maybe eventually I'll memorize where things are, but no way uh, now. So, what we're going to do is we're going to... Uh, Oh, he didn't put the... Which cafe? Crap. It's a cafe in the southern district of Lumoy City. Hmm. Are we in so southern right now? I want to say we are. So let's... Introversion? I don't think it's cafe introversion. I'll check. It's... Okay. Now it's kind of process of elimination. Um, because I don't know. I want to say it's this one over here, maybe? What is this one? Hey, how do I get in? Oh, that's not a cafe. Ugh, I hate the camera in this town. It's the Pokemon Center. We'll find this. That's... I 
think it's this. Yes, so you'll see Diantha here, the champion. Oh, why, hello there. That's right. This is where I first met you, isn't it, Poldu? You know, I'd really love to learn more about how a strong trainer like you raises his Pokemon. This probably seems a bit sudden, but how would you feel about trading one of your Pokemon for my routes here? So if you say yes, this is like the trade uh, after the Elite Four with Shauna. You just give her anything. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure I caught a female one on X already. That was the only point of keep catching this combi, but I'm pretty sure I already got one. <laughs> we trainers all feel a bit nervous when trading Pokemon, but I'm sure it's nothing compared to how the Pokemon must feel. So you trade her anything you want. Uh, so maybe you want to go catch a Caterpie or something before doing this. And she will trade you a Ralts. I don't remember if it has a name or not. Nope, it's just Ralts. So if you didn't want a Ralts or Gardevoir or whatever named something weird, don't have to worry. Hello, Combi. I'm glad to meet you. Was it a bit shocking to be traded? I hope you'll come to trust and like me. I promise that I'll take good care of you. So if we look at the routes we just got... Oh. <laughs> Again, it's in my inventory. If we go and look at the routes we just received... Pokemon Center was right here, correct? Yes. We will see that it is holding... Oh. All papers are ready to commemorate your first time clearing the game. Haven't been to my PC since that. Uh, we go look at Ralts. Uh, the Ralts is now holding the Gardevoir rights. So, um, the only Megastone left to res um, yeah, the only Megastone left after that would be the Mewtwoonite, which we will be doing next episode. Um, which is, you have to go capture Mewtwo, and you get the Mega Stone that way. Um, I'm actually not sure, like, I would save before the encounter just to make sure, because I don't know if you're able to, like, thief it from him. I, it's, like, I, I'm just not sure. So, if you're going to go do that, make sure you save before the fight, that way you can actually capture him. And, uh, yeah, those are all the Mega Stones in the game. Um, let me just double check the list here. Yep, that was all of them. So, took two days to record this, <laughs> but I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Hope you learned. Um, ho hope you learned where, where and how to get your Mega Stones, and uh, we will see you guys next time.